Today what we have for you here is the 180 degree Wi-Fi Glow Panoramic Camera from A-Zone. Now this bad boy comes with alarm action, uh, HD video format, Wi-Fi, uh, local storage, you can shove your SD card in there, um, audio input and output, and night vision. That's pretty cool. Can't wait to try that out. All right, that should be awesome. See, my first response is, I don't really don't like that there's no tape or anything uh, securing that to the box. Makes me feel like I'm unboxing a used item, even though we got this brand new. Let's see what that looks like here. Instruction manual right at the top, um, although we're just gonna figure that out on our own. We have the main camera right here, uh, very lightweight, and the secured film right here. So you have the lens, A-Zone, name of the company. Uh, there's your audio output, and I see we're going to have a uh, micro USB charging. And can't really see that, but there is a small reset button. I wonder what that would be used for. Um, all right, then here is your micro USB cable, um, the stand with some handy screws, and the power brick for the micro USB. What you're looking at here is the IPC360 app, the app that's going to let you interact with your camera while you're away from the house. Tapping the icons on the bottom left hand side of the app will allow you to toggle volume as well as take a picture. The icons on the bottom right hand side allows you to take a video as well as change the definition of that video so that you can save space on your mobile device. When you press and hold that center button that says press to talk, it allows you to do just that. You can speak through the security camera itself and address anybody that's on the other end of that security camera. If you put an SD card into the camera, you can use that timeline bar that's directly above the press to talk button to go back and see previous footage that the security camera has recorded. Um, however, without the SD card, that feature is essentially useless to you. This is what it looks like when you take a picture or video within the app itself. Previously, I showed you a screenshot of what the application looks like so that you can get a feel for it and the features that are available to you. This is approximately the quality that you would get when you take a picture and store it on your phone. I also wanted you to see the quality of the pictures that you would expect to get from this security camera. In the previous screenshot, we were showing off the night vision capabilities, but this is what you would expect to see when you're checking up on your security camera in the middle of the day. I think the picture quality that we get for that $40 price tag on the security camera is great. I think the interface of the app itself is very user friendly and the ability to communicate through that camera using the press to talk feature is awesome. But this device is not perfect. I noticed when I activated the camera, it had a very bright flashing green light that continuously blinked on and off. So if you're looking for an inconspicuous camera, this one might not be for you. That about does it for the A-Zone Cloud Camera. Link in the description below. It's about $40 on Amazon. And as long as you have $40 expectations for a security camera, I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. See you next time.